my passion was to pursue energy studies and grid scale energy applications and where i needed to work on uh, solutions to reduce the carbon emissions and that's why i wanted to go through the energy course and that's why i chose grandfield for that the highlight of my time here would be the group project i would say and uh, the, the, i was uh, working on a project which was sponsored by rolls royce and it was one of the uh, high profile projects and i, I loved doing it and uh, i also had some extraordinary modules i was working on some renewable energy uh, real world problems to solve uh, uh, carbon emissions and uh, courses like that yeah so that was good My group project's title is uh, Techno Economic Analysis of Small Modular Nuclear Reactors, and the purpose of it was to increase the efficiency of the nuclear reactors using supercritical CO2 cycles and uh, integrating thermal storage uh, for grid flexibility. Due to the influx of renewables, you need low carbon energy, energy sources, which can uh, which can compete with the fossil fuel plants. When it comes to nuclear, it's it's a uh, it's a low carbon energy source, so. Uh, uplifting that is one of the key criteria that we had so uh, by incorporating thermal storage we were able to to grid flexibility and uh, uh, put more of the small modular reactors which are more cost effective than the huge large uh, nuclear power plants that we have right now so and our supervisors were very helpful in this project and uh, we got the excellent opportunity to work with rolls royce uh, hand, hand to hand face to face so it was it was awesome I should say that I am a kind of person who loves the classroom atmosphere, you know. But it was quite tough uh, getting used to the online. We are in a different world right now, and we need to get used to all of this. And uh, it, it was quite tough, but still, I love the modules and how they managed in my course specifically. It was really good. And uh, one of the ma management modules, we were laughing and learning, and it was it was a lot of fun actually. So there's no uh, degradation in the quality of the course whatsoever. pretty calm <laughs> uh, it's a it's a natural environment here it's a it's kind of a village uh, but you also have access to london oxford or cambridge uh, nearby huge cities which we can explore actually right now the lockdown is just getting uh, ended so we are just starting to explore right now so it's it's a lot a lot of fun two things actually uh, one favorite memory is uh, uh, the memories that i have with my uh people from the accommodation from different nationalities the friends that i got from here and the second one would be uh after two weeks after my group project actually i read a news article which was kind of related to our group project and seeing that the work that we do is getting reflected out there in the world it was it was a wonderful feeling and that was one of my favorite moments i'm very passionate about the energy industry so i want to work on solutions to uh to reduce the uh, uh carbon emissions and i also want want to uh, be a part of the fight against climate change so at, at least within 10 years i don't know where i'm going to be but i want to be in a prominent role fighting climate change my personal advice it would be that take a chance in your passion you know so uh you don't know what's going to be on the other side of the door anyways nobody knows that but still if you take a chance i think it will surprise you cranfield open a lot of doors for me i took a chance and it surprised me and i learned a lot from that as well to sum up i would say it's a place of opportunities friends and uh, innovation that would be the best definition for cranfield i guess